Fasting can be a difficult practice, but it can also be a powerful one. By abstaining from food, you can focus your attention on God and seek His guidance and intervention in our life. Fasting can also help you to break free from bad habits and addictions, and it can bring you closer to God. The Power of Prayer and Fasting The power of prayer and fasting lies in their ability to bring you closer to God. These practices help you to focus on God and seek His guidance and intervention in your life. They also help you to break free from bad habits and addictions and bring you closer to God. In Matthew 17 20-21, Jesus taught his disciples that some demons can only be driven out through prayer and fasting. This passage emphasizes the power of prayer and fasting in breaking the chains of spiritual bondage and oppression. In the book Acts 13 2-3, the leaders of the church in Antioch fasted and prayed before sending out Paul and Barnabas on their missionary journey. This passage highlights the importance of prayer and fasting in seeking God's guidance, and direction in our lives. So how do you pray and fast? Prayer and fasting can be challenging practices, but as a child of God you must do it, because it's essential for Christian spiritual journey. Here are some practical tips to help you how to pray and fast effectively. Set aside time, set aside time each day for your prayer and Bible study. This can be in the morning, evening, or any time that works best for you. Use the Bible, use the Bible as a guide for your prayers. Pray the Psalms or other passages that speak to your heart, because Bible is the only way God can speak to you. Meditate on His words and claim His promises. Stay hydrated, if you are fasting, be sure to drink plenty of water to stay hydrated. You may also want to consider fasting and staying away from social media, TV, or other distractions to help you focus on God. Because social media can distract you. The power of prayer and fasting lies in the ability to bring you closer to God. These practices help you to focus on God, remember, a prayerless Christian is a weak and faithless Christian, why don't you stand on your feet and move that mountain, that long waiting problem, God has the power, he is ever God, and he never let anyone down, seeking him is the only way to stop that ending problem doctors of the earth cannot solve, seeking is him the only way to break that yoke of affliction, God is able.